Welcome everyone to Juno Sweet Justice Commentary. Guys, I would like to thank you guys so very much for this request. I got three requests for Bangkok first time and I had to tell the person who requested it that I actually um, reacted to two of the video, two out of the three video requests. But there's one video I have not seen so I'm not going to check it out. Of course, in the past I have reacted to Bangkok first time and it was so funny. This guy is so funny. The best one I love was the Thai ghost. That was very funny and also ordering Thai food. That was that was just great. I want to thank you guys so very much for requesting. It's been a while I've been reacting to Bangkok for some, but for sure the memory of laughter and awe shock is still in there. Okay, thank you so very much. Let's go ahead. For Bangkok first time, of course. It was hilarious. That's it's been a while. Oh by the way, I'm gonna be eating. I'm gonna be eating. Nelson Howe, professor of philosophy, here we go. <laughs> I lived in Bangkok for three years. This is the story of my first time in Bangkok. Mm. By the way, guys, this is like pepper, a lot of peppers, seasoned pepper, not hot pepper, ham, egg, and diced bread. Of course, it's very delicious. Bangkok, first time. Bangkok, first time. Okay. Everything. Bus, taxi, but I like walking the most. Mm, I like walking too. I like walking because there are so many interesting graffiti in Bangkok. Oh, Bangkok graffitis? They are different in terms of linguistic complexity. Oh. American graffiti are mostly about gangster shit. Oh. They are boring. <laughs> not and the worst thing is I can't even read them. <laughs> Meanwhile, Thailand is like the postmodern era of graffiti. The graffiti are very high concept. Their concept it's a pity I don't have it's a pity I don't understand what the graffiti is are saying. Perhaps you guys can let me in the comment section. Have no concept. I mean, I've had long experience in conceptual art before. Mm -hmm. But I have never seen something like this. Look at the arrangement on the wall. It's more than beautiful. <laughs> it's it's intellectually romantic. It's heavenly. <laughs> I know this guy, Duke Bunkby, who lives Duke adventurously in the world of education. Legend says hmm. he eats the enemy's signature belts for breakfast. What? But what I'm impressed about, Duke Bunkby, is how he stands out in the world of graffiti art. So he, he's the one doing the graffiti art? Uh, of, the, of the three uh, graffitis here. Which one is your favorite, you think? Oh, he's gonna speak Thai. I wish we were speaking English, nonetheless. It's you guys' job to tell me what he's saying. ไม่ไม่ใช่อย่างนั้นคือเขาไม่หลบซ่อนความหมายอย่างศิลปินท่านนี้เนี่ย <laughs> เขาพูดตรงๆเลยว่าแบบความแล้งแค้นในวัดเด็กอ่ะมันออกมาเลยกับเส้นที่บิดเบี้ยวอะไรอย่างเงี้ยกับความแฟร์เดียนกับความเข
I also admire the education system in Thailand mm -hmm. as it implants the respective institution to many students. While most graffiti in the U.S. are about bullshit gangster stuff, <laughs> Thai graffiti focus on the education content. They are usually about establishment of their school or the proudness of their institution. This is amazing. I have never seen any Ivy League students spray on the wall like Harvard since 1636 or Princeton evening class uh -huh. or Stanford daddy of all. <laughs> Ivy <laughs> League is shit compared to Thai dudes. No. According to my research, Thai graffitis are not common. They even have another kind of graffiti. Another kind of graffiti? This kind of graffiti <coughs> hides in a very unexpected and intimate place. Intimate? It is in public restrooms. What? And the great thing is, this graffiti interacts with its audiences. Every audience interaction with the work drives the content forward. I can tell you this. That's a phone number? This is such a conceptual and improvisational piece of art. <laughs> Don't forget, I got Duke Bunkpi with me. Oh, <laughs> Duke Bunkpi, you can't hear me in the toilet. If you could tell me the meaning of the one on the right, can it fuck you? <laughs> Guys, you did not tell it, and he's heard these two dudes in the washroom talking about. Can I, you, I'm. Come on, fans, I want it now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> let me get out of here. Let me get out of here. Oh, gosh. This is insane. Yeah, but I don't <laughs> want to talk about it. <laughs> oh, God, he's going to join the crew now. Oh shoot. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Is it illegal to do good I'm graffiti in Thailand like the police can arrest you?